talented young athlete, and Jason has won gold at the last three World Insulting Championships. <laughs> Practice makes perfect. <laughs> And uh, talking of uh, sporting talent, up next, a footballing legend who's uh, made many great saves, but his most recent catch is his skating partner. It's David Seaman and Frankie. I believe that Chris and Jane have been talking that me and Frankie are the dark horses and uh, that we could win this thing, but uh, we'll let people decide. I can't wait to skate with Frankie. We're engaged. She's my other half and all that sort of stuff. We're just really, really looking forward to this one. How cool is it that we're doing the show Amazing. together? Amazing. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> well, sound effects and everything. <laughs> Excellent. David and Frankie, it was one of those tour relationships that seemed to blossom. They've continued to skate together over the past several years. That's made them better skaters. Oh, nice. He has really nice, good, strong skating skills. If he can combine that with this wonderful relationship with Frankie, he'll be smoking. When David was in the previous series, his partner had a few unfortunate uh, incidents. On the first part, I'll be able to tell you now. Is this a headbanger? Oh, I don't know if I can watch. Oh, oh. It's going to be nerve wracking going out there with Frankie, because obviously I want to take extra care of her. We're hoping that he can prove to the judges and to the public that this time he's going to get it right. I'm hoping that. I'm sure I'll be all right. She's in safe hands. Skating to You Really Got Me, 2006 semi-finalist David Seaman with Frankie. He won four FA Cups, but he says nothing frays the nerves quite like this. Safe hands, yes, usually just one awkward moment, and there it was in the thread the needle. But uh, things went a lot better. The headbanger was terrific. And we finished with the step up and the evil Knievel. Great recovery. Right, the judges' scores are in. Robin Cousins, 5.5. Karen Barber, 6.5. Ashley Roberts, 5. Jason Gardner, 5.5. That's a total of 22.5. A little bit of a mess up there. A little bit. How are you? Right? I messed my hands up. Yeah? <laughs> All over okay? me and my hands. <laughs> How do you feel about the scores? 
They're okay. I'm yeah. happy with them, yeah. Let, let's, get the, <laughs> let's get the comments. Okay, a 6.5, Karen, actually, yeah. as a couple there. That's a really good score, considering he's not well, completely happy. Well, considering what could have happened, I have to say that was definitely a game of two halves. <laughs> but you, you brought it back. <laughs> yeah. The elements that you did were really strong, and my mark gave credit for that, mm -hmm. but it would have been a lot higher. Mm -hmm. Ashley? Yeah, David, there was, there was moments in the beginning where you were selling it to me. I mean, this is like a dude's song, too. I kind of wanted you to, like, have fun and be like, yeah, out there. And then, obviously, there was a little mishap. But make sure you don't throw away the movements, too. You had that little bop, bop, bop. Make sure you land that, because everything has a purpose. Mm -hmm. And uh, Jason? Yeah, I would echo what uh, Ashley has said. I mean, David, you know, your, your skating has improved. There were some great lifts that I never thought you would be able to do, actually. <laughs> and you got the headbanger, and you didn't smash her face in. So, <laughs> hey, it's all good, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> David, you're big and you run the risk of being a bit dull. You've got to inject some real personality in it. Because the thing is, Frankie has such character and personality. She's so strong. You've got to come up to her level now, OK? <laughs> and bring that onto the ice. I'll try. No, yeah. you have to do it. He's yeah. not dull, he was concentrating. Yeah. Well, that's exactly. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> You've got to find the performance, yeah. please. Yeah. Totally yeah. understand. I've right. got to pick up on that very point, because fortunately, David, you did focus what, on what you needed to do once it all started to go slightly wrong. Yeah. So the fact that you focused on Frankie and on getting the steps right, but you cannot do that week after week at the expense of the performance when Frankie will be giving us what she gives week in, week out. You are a very gentle giant and the skating is very smooth. Could have, for me, been a bit more rock and roll, but at, at least you were safe and controlled. Mm -hmm. So is it easier being a partnership in, you know, outside in real life uh, or is it harder no i think it's easier you know we we, we get a lot more time to uh, to train um and we understand each other more you know i know i know totally what the judges are saying you know the showman in me is really hard to find yeah. but you know we'll have a go at trying finding it more nerve-wracking potentially walking down the aisle or doing this <laughs> i've been down the aisle a few times but no, that's what we're <laughs> <laughs> down the aisle. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you won't be skating down it. <laughs> um, the judges said his skating has improved. It has improved. I mean, it was safe hands tonight. That's good. No sleeping on the couch tonight. Exactly. That's a good Thank thing. You. But I have to say, it's gotten better. We are going to have a work on that performance. Yeah. He gets so nervous. That's the thing. And now we've got that one out of the way, Let's put those away and let's concentrate on the performance to give a stronger performance. Right, cool. guys, thank you very much indeed. Thank well, you. the ice brought Dave and Frankie together, but only your votes can keep them on it. Lines open at the end of the show. For now, it's David and Frankie. <laughs> Love in the air. Why not share your deepest feelings about the show by joining in the online chat at Facebook or Twitter? Details are on your screen right now. 